I want to say two things. I've been in politics for 40 years. I have never experienced as a difficult time that Kenya is going through as today. I've never experienced as a difficult time that Kenya is going through as today. So let us take this moment seriously. Many things, uh, Kisumu County, this one we can sort out. Kuna shida. Lakini ile siyasa kitaifa. Lazima tuwe macho. Because Kenya is going through a tremendous transition. There are two choices this nation must make. Either we hang together as a nation or separate separately as ethnic communities. That moment has never been as stuck as now. The latter choice is no choice. The former is. So we have to do everything together to unite as a nation in terms of national integration and in terms of having a legitimate state and government that people believe in without lip service, but with a commitment to a national ideology, national development. There has never been a time as difficult as now because it's challenged. If we can hold election three times, 2007, 2013, 2017, how did you expect the 2023 election to be any different, except to be stolen like the others? Because the dominant class in state, I'm saying in state, not in society, has all the instruments at its disposal to subvert democracy and subvert national unity which we are all committed to and we want. Therefore, let me say this very clearly, tafadali, this is the moment we must take very seriously and focus on the national agenda. The national agenda, the national crisis. There's never been a moment in history that we need our leader, Raila Molodinga, like today not only to save this region, to save the nation, not because he only wants to be president, but he has shown historically that the reform agenda is his baby. I'm a civil, and he's committed that reform agenda no matter what time of the day you wake him up or you see him talking. So that, that, that experience that we have had three times before, and now the fourth time, where this national agenda cannot be realized through a state project called elections. Elections are state project. You can't determine the results of election in Kisumu. You have to determine Nairobi. There's a body called IABC. You should, maintain, you should manage it. If this IABC has not been able to manage election 2007, 2013, 2017, we were naive to think that in 2023 that same IBC can do anything different. We had faith, but that faith has been abused. So, Ogotamsi, Adwani Yuluo Ogotamsi, so that we can focus very carefully on the next step. If our leader is in South Africa, South Africa is not going there for a holiday. There's a purpose. He must consult continentally and internationally in the future of this nation. And he's the only person at this point in time in history whom I know myself. Capable and prepared to do that. I'm sorry I talk like this, but I thought I would seize this moment, my fellow clergy, to deliver this message. Because the people I see here, the people are very politically alert and committed. Buona Yesu Hallelujah!